Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in to my YouTube channel. I made a quick video just to explain why Arkansas diamonds are worth a lot more than what the locals and regular diamond miners say they are worth. Here we have a diamond that isn't resorbed, meaning it's in its natural formation. And 98% of the Arkansas diamonds are resorbed. You know, resorbed means that it was melted during the eruption from 120 miles below these diamonds caught a ride up in some volcanic material and was pushed up and lost their formation like all of these here are considered resorbed diamonds the biggest is a 1.03 carat the diamond that we first looked at it's not resorbed so it's not 10 to 20 dollars a point like the regulars would say it would be worth because um, a lot of those guys, you know, they could go find 100 diamonds, you know, in a month and then sell their diamonds for 5 to $10 a point just so they could get back out there and keep finding more diamonds when really those diamonds are worth a lot more than 10 to $20 a point. You know, here is a perfectly formed, resorbed white and you know it's not your twenty dollars at all a point for that diamond it's going to be worth a lot more so you know just because the regulars say that the diamonds are only worth nine dollars you know i hear fifteen dollars a point you know that's a lie these are arkansas resorbed diamonds they are 28 to 30 percent stronger than African diamonds. You can't take an African diamond and cut Arkansas diamonds. It's just going to break it. So the quality is the best that is known in the world so far. Um, Henry Ford wanted to buy the Crater of Diamonds after the mining operations gave it a quit because he could use this to cut metal and for drill bits because he knew that these diamonds were stronger and he would be having a lot better drill bits for drilling into metal um so yeah just because the regulars say these are only worth five to fifteen dollars a point don't don't listen if you find a flawless diamond at the credit diamonds hang on to it do not sell it to a local for ten dollars a point or even twenty dollars a point it's your diamond you found it it's worth whatever you want for it you know, here's James Archer. You know, this man found over 7,000 plus diamonds. Over 100 of those were over one carat. You know, and he sold his for $5 a point and less. He gave a lot of diamonds away. You know, all this equipment today costs more money. The entry fees aren't $5 to get it. It's $10 per person. You know, cage fees to rent a cage to store all of your equipment like I have here. You know, it's 60 plus a month instead of $30 a month like when I started in 2016. So I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you got a little bit of information that Arkansas diamonds are not like African diamonds. They're stronger. They're rare. And thanks for tuning in. Please hit that subscribe button and have a great day.